Moves. It's your girl, Nashe. What's up? What's good? We are going to open this Montana West box and reveal this amazing summer bag. Ready? One, two, three. Voila! Yes, I picked this up, I want to say, at the very, very end of spring knowing that I wanted to rock this in the summer. And so I am so happy to be pulling this out this box and checking out this bag right now. This was a Amazon find for less than $20. And by the looks of it, it was a really good buy. So this is a faux leather. It has a ostrich embossed texture. I love these straps. Everything feels so sturdy. And I'm just really pleased so far. I haven't even worn the bag yet, but everything feels good. And this color is amazing. I am definitely an 80s baby. And so I love these bright colors. It just takes me back to the 80s into the 90s. And I'm absolutely here for it so this bag i'll be rocking today me and my family are headed out to the grocery store so i'm gonna take this bag with me the insides is pretty much you know the regular setup that we're used to so very spacious i must add we have the inner pockets two slip pockets and a zippered pocket and we have this gorgeous little clutch what a nice what a nice touch. So excited about this. So I'm going to go ahead and get ready. I'm going to rock her with these sneakers. My mom gave me these and I pull these out every now and again. They definitely go with this handbag. So let's go. Yeah, I'm ready to go, you guys. Come on with me. All right. So this is the full fit. I have on this denim dress. It is like an acid wash faded jean situation and I'm here for it and this bright, bright bag. Let's go. So as much as I enjoy Atlanta, I'm not gonna say I'm in love with Atlanta, but I do enjoy some things about Atlanta. It's really hard for me to find a authentic cultural grocery store with foods that I grew up with. So when I'm able to go out to certain markets and grab things that I absolutely love, like this incense right here, I am there for it because, hey, I cannot find these things. I can find incense in Atlanta, but when it comes to like certain foods that I wanna make and dishes that I grew up eating, I have to go outside of Atlanta to really get the items that I want. So I was happy to find this space right here. And I'll definitely be heading back regularly, especially when I'm in the mood for some childhood delights or just some food that, you know, my mother used to make for me when I was just a girl. So that's what we did. We hopped in the car and just made it a whole family run family situation and we enjoyed ourselves picked up some salt fish some breadfruit some fresh callaloo and i'm about to eat 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 okay really excited about this on the way out i was tempted to grab some watermelon but i did not because i think i do still have some left at the house but i was so pleased to see that this little store was also giving away free popcorn to their patrons what a nice touch you know so i'll definitely be coming back to this spot right here so we are all set and we're getting ready to go home it was a great little outing, and I am ready to transform and prepare for my evening. So once I got in and got settled, I unpacked my bag and realized that I was going to take this little clutch out for date night. There is this little loop on the back, and that made it super convenient to turn it into a go out bag I just threw on a detachable strap from a different purse and I was good to go so I'm super pleased with myself at this point 
had to slip off my sneakers and throw on some sandals and I was ready to walk out the door. Now, where is that husband of mine? <laughs> So not only was the clutch really cute, really bright, she also held my basic needs, my phone, my perfume, my lip gloss, and my cards. There's just something magical about this little Mexican restaurant close to my house. I just love it here. It truly is a break from the mundane. So I enjoyed my meal and the conversation with my this husband. This looks crazy as hell. Needless to say, the little restaurant was not all that. It was more impressive on the outside than it actually was on the inside. The ice cream was uh, not that great, nothing to write home about, but we did get a few scoops. We did giggle and continue to enjoy ourselves. We had a great time together as we usually do. And after that, we headed on home. Peace and love y'all.